I'm really hoping there's. I'm really hoping there's no. I'll 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 a bum a bum. Uh, ain't. I'm really hoping there's no Cthulhu-like monster behind the store. Uh huh. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh God. There's another elevator. Okay. Up. Up. Oh, it's Scorpion. Oh. Gosh. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Those... Those are complete Valkyrie Sentry Drones. And there's another right there. Oh no, and if it isn't the bug himself. Scorpion, I'm calling you out. What are you doing down here? You can't be down here. You aren't supposed to remember anything about this place. Ugh. You two again. To what, the, to what do I have the pleasure of this time? You know exactly what, you twisted fiends. Now answer my question. Such hostility, especially from you two. I'm building a new type of sentry bot. The Valkyrie Sentry Joe, if I'm correct. My partner tells me they're quite the exceptional model. If the schematics are correct, I designed them in my previous life. The one who calls himself Hunter says that after I activate them, it shouldn't be long before I get my memory back. I love to remember this place. I've been liking it from the beginning. If my assumptions are correct about the doors, you two are the ones that have been messing around with the controls in my lab. It's not your lab anymore. You lost it when you lost your memory. That doesn't change the fact that I built it so long ago. My space station is nearly operational. I only came down here to get something Hunter said was very important. So the station needed it. After that, my super weapon I so appropriately named the SOP DPG will charge and turn the dimension known as the force segment into pure energy. That of which I will absorb into my core. I will then be at 30% of my full power capacity. Well, I'm not going to allow you to do this, you hear? I receive your audio as clear as day. But alas, you have both fooled yourselves into thinking you can stop the inevitable. I am a devious four. We cannot be stopped. I will destroy that pathetic realm and all of its power will be mine. And with the official reinstatement of the Valkyrie Sentry, the space station will be complete. But it's not like you two will live to see the station in its glory. For you will both be vaporized. What? No, you can't. If you reactivate the Valkyrie drones, no one will be able to control them. If they're released, then it'll be the end of us all. No, it'll be the end of you. They'll recognize me as their creator and see you two as a couple of cupcakes on a silver platter, ready for them to snack on. And with the flip of a switch, they'll all fly off, stationed at my space station. Good luck getting to the vault with the kind of luck you've had on trip. No! Don't do it! Hello, Code Yellow. Can you hear me? Yes, Scorpion Creator. We are at your command. It's been a long time since I've seen you, but I recognize your eyes all too well. Valkyrie Sentry Code Yellow. Un Unit 874A is at your service, my liege. Excellent. You see those two? How can I forget the mustached one? He's caused my brother so much pain. I wish to train him to rotten flesh. Go on ahead. I'll wake up your brothers and you all will head for the space station. After you're done here, rendezvous with the rest of the vault not too far from here. You'll all then be transported to the station where you'll be assigned guard tasks. You'll be Commander Kites. Understood. Commander Kite has name acknowledged. What will you have me do at the vault? You will all wait for me. I have a very special order that needs to be done. Acknowledged. I'll stop Mario while you wake up my sleeping brothers. Alright, I can take care. I, I can do this. This I can do. Except for the part where it's in total darkness. That, I don't think I'm going to be able to do as much. Plus, I'm dealing with a very damaged hitbox. So, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of... So, I'm kind of a bit iffed at the moment. Where is he? 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 Oh, where is he? There he is. Use the hitbox. There you go. 
And then there he goes. Okay, I won that somehow. Somehow. I have to go back down, alright? Fair enough. Back out. It's okay. All this, this is all familiar territory. This is good. This is good for me. It's nice and familiar territory. I like that. Except now I think I have to actually leave now. Uh, were you lit up before? If you don't mind, Mario, I'm gonna check this computer again. Yep. Looks like Scorpion has built about 70 or so Valkyries and released all of them. He cleared the computer of the designs. My best guess is that he took them with him to his vault. Darn it! If only we defeated quite quicker. I don't know, we kind of defeated him pretty easily. Actually, he kind on his own. He's only around to stall us. Wow. Scorpion sure cleared out. For a guy who, who, who's, who's friends are, he's probably just as quick as he was before. And if he woke up all the Valkyries and left them that quickly, that can only mean bad news. Hey, wait a second. What's this? It says Vault on the file. Let's check it out. Well, what do you know? The program to access the vaults. Hey, there's a note left here. Let's see. <laughs> you nitwits actually found it. My best guess is that you both were not smart enough to look through any of these computers before heading off. You two are idiots. If you couldn't find the program the first time you used one of these, one of the computers, it means you're an idiot. Redundant much? If you had to come back to the same computer a second time to find the program, it means you're an idiot. Called it. What on earth am I saying if for? You two are idiots. Plain and simple. I can't wait to see what your faces look like when you realize everything you've done will have no effect in Scorpion's plan. Goodbye, idiots. You amused me well. Hunter. Okay, that was Hunter's note. That was very staccato. Well, that sucks. Anyway, let's get that insulting letter out of heads and let's go... Whoa, check out that sweetness. Authorization to use the laser back in that laboratory. Let's go. You have to go all the way back to the library now. It's okay. It's not as bad as it was before. I've managed to maintain my sanity. I can't go back that way. I can go back this way, though. This door. I, I, I'm, I'm glad that it's almost over because that means that that I can that, that everything's going to be just fine. Everything's going to be just fine. I think we're back in the main area now. I can't, I can't really remember. I can't go through that door. Uh, I think the laboratory way was over here. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, there's drones here. Dead. 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 Not me dead. Them dead. Thank you. Use it. Alrighty then. Are you ready to do this? Don't do it. Don't do it. Well, Lord knows I'm ready to say bye to this place, but I'm not exactly all too excited to meet Mr. Spike Pillar again. Hey, I'm not too excited to go back either, but it's our only way out. We have no other choice. Oh, okay. Well, with that in mind, let's start this machine up and get out of here. Hey, you don't think them artifacts missing will affect the trip, right? Nah. For all we know, since this machine is in a different area, you might not even meet Spike Pillar this time. Alright, let's go. Uh, where am I going now? Oh, jeez! Oh, God! What's going on? Oh, God. Oh, God. I didn't do anything. I didn't touch anything, I swear. Oh. Okay. 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 <coughs> okay. I'm all right. I'm 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 fine. I'm fine. Just I'm 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 fine. I'm fine. I, I'm 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 fine. 
Alright? I'm totally just fine. Halfway point is good. Halfway point is great. That means that, that if something bad happens... What are you? Wow. Anybody gain that feeling of deja vu or is it just me? Yeah, I remember this place. We came here not long ago. And some scary ass stuff got creeped out and opened a portal back. No problem. You wanna know what the worst part is about all this? What? A spike pillar was here to greet us. So the two areas really are one and the same. Only this one's much more... something. Yeah, check out that mountain in the distance. If we came from a different area, shouldn't that mountain be facing a different direction or something? I don't know. I don't know what on earth is going on here. Hey, check that out. Cool, looks like something left by some drones. Didn't Hunter's Log mention some drones from long ago? Yeah, it did. Alright, let's read this. This is Drone 666 reporting in with the Daily Log. The first of May to come for sure. First things first, we need to state who we are, why we're here, and what our mission is. We're a squadron of seven drones. I'm 666, leader of the squadron. For security reasons, we've been armed with four sentry drones and one of these newer, more elite Valkyrie units. The Code Red, Scorpion called them. We're here because of a fluctuation in the space-time ripple that Scorpion had detected in this very area. He believes there might be another portal to the orbital void located in this realm. Scorpion had detected it and created it some sort of machine based on the incredible tech we found while digging at the crystal mountain around these chambers. When he completed the machine, I was skeptical into thinking it would actually work. Looks like I was proven wrong. But we know where we are right now. From the looks of things, we'll find a good area to set up an outpost and start work. There's not much room here. It's easy to fall off the vast cliffs. Upon setting up the outpost, we're to contact Scorpion right away. Let him know of progress. He'll tell us where we need to go. We hope to find something soon. I don't know about this. This seems like a new team sent here. I don't remember Hunter mentioning a drone 666. For all we know, this team could have just been sent here. You've got to remember that Scorpion doesn't remember anything. He doesn't know about the orbital void. Oh, okay, so what does that mean? The team was sent a long while back. They've got to be the team that Hunter was refer was referencing in that log of his. Oh, oh, okay then. Let's move and find this outpost then. Chances are there may be more logs left by this drone 666. Maybe we can finally find out what happened to them. Fair enough. Thank you. Finally something that works. Ooh, a, a computer? Doesn't work. Alright, so this is the outpost left by... Well, I think that was the outpost left by Drone 666 and his team. And yeah, he's right. There's very precarious cliffs here. I'm not entirely sure what's going on, but we're apparently moving to a new section. Holy crap. This is the outpost, isn't it? Can't go into there. There's a device here. I'm not entirely sure what it does. There's doors. Can't enter any of them. There's a net. Another log? Outpost computer terminal. Press start at any time day terminal. Alright, we'll see we're doing a lot of reading. Day one. This is drone 666 reporting in with the daily log. I love starting out like that. Anyway, we found a good spot for the outpost, so we'll start construction as soon as we get the materials delivered. Scorpion said they'd be arriving about 12 hours after we've searched. It's been 11 hours and 56 minutes. My good friend 627 said it'd be a good idea to leave these logs on our path so we'd find a way back if anything happened. 8962 says we shouldn't worry with Valkyrie Unit 48AB with us. They're really efficient. Anyway, we're gonna set our stuff up, then report back. This is Drone 666 reporting in with the daily log. A daily log, I log, um, daily. So we have our outpost set up. The accelerator drainer is ready to get started, and we're ready to start our research. We found a large hole not far from here, and there's a really large mountain very, very far from here. Way out of the normal visibility range. Something's weird about this place. I always get the feeling I'm not alone. Even when I am. I'm not telling the others. They'll get worried and send me back. I want to do this. I want to prove to Scorpion I'm useful for more than guard duty. I want to make my name remembered. This is Drone 666 reporting in with the daily log. I'm not really feeling that well today about it, actually. We got the outpost set up and all, but it looks like it won't do any good. Nothing works. We've been here for more than five days now. Not a single contact from Scorpion at all. 
It doesn't help that we can't even establish one. We've set up all these computers for nothing. We try to crank the generator ourselves, but it's like it doesn't want to budge. This is just horrible. Our Valkyrie drone randomly shuts off at unexpected intervals. I don't remember Scorpion telling me it needed for maintenance of some sort. Drones 867 and 8962 started talking to themselves lately. I think the lack of progress is starting to get to their heads. We're going to head back to the portal entrance and see if we can get back. Hopefully it isn't too late. This is Drone 666 reporting in with the, the daily log. The portal's gone. It's actually gone. We're officially stranded in this goddamned place. I hope God curses it until the end of time. This is bad. Really bad. We've returned to the outpost. Unfortunately, things were not as we left them. Drones 897 and 8, 867 and 8962 were left on watch along with two of the sentry bots. The two drones had completely trashed the place and were muttering gibberish. Sentry Blue 87 was ripped to shreds. I think 627 can fix, them up, can fix them up, probably tell us what happened. In the meantime, we have 867 and 8962 in quarantine until they can calm down. It must have been a panic of shock. Chances are we won't even let them out until we can go back. That Valkyrie sentry shuts off more and more frequently. Sometimes when he recovers, his eyes are purple. I wonder what in God's good name is wrong with this place. I still get the feeling I'm being watched. And I'm starting to hear voices. This is Drone 666 reporting in the daily log. 867 and 8962 are in a coma now. They've completely shut down. 627 got Sentry Blue 87 back up and running. He was disassembled by the two rogue units. I try to talk to him, but he's way too scared. The sentries have never been scared of Mario, so why get scared here? Is there actually something something that's worse than Mario and Eleni out there? Come on, Blue 87, we need to hear something. Speaking of sentries, I also got 627 to check up on the Valkyrie drone. He says he can't find anything wrong, even double-checking and cross-examining the blueprints with the design. I don't know what on earth is going on uh, is, is, is up here, but it's starting to get to all of us. That mountain I mentioned from before? It appears to be closer, and the voices are getting louder. This is Drone 666. I'm reporting in with another daily log. Valkyrie Sentry 48AB has completely disappeared. We have no idea where he could have gone. Did he return home? I'd rather get kicked upside the head by Hunter a thousand times than stay here any longer. The voices. I can't get these voices out of my head. I can't understand them. What's wrong with me? I know basic psychology and the first rule is to admit something's wrong. There's something wrong, but I don't know what it is. I can't let the others notice. I'm their leader and I got to show them that we can make it through this. If God gets us out of here, I promise to help purge planets faster than usual so we can get home. The sentries don't respond to our commands anymore. All they do is sit there on patrol, looking for something that's not us. They keep looking at the mountain like they're waiting for someone. Or even worse, like they know someone's there. This is Drone 666. I'm reporting in with the now weekly log. It's been harder getting the motivation to write these things. It's these voices. They're making it hard to concentrate. Drone 5769, one I've neglected to mention in the past long, has also started talking to himself now. I can only fear that he'll turn out like the other two. I'm going to reassure him later that he's not alone in this, this syndrome we're all experiencing. We want to see Scorpion. We want to see Hunter. But we know we can't. One of the sentry bots disappeared earlier today. I'm not about to send the only three sane drones left to go find him. It's too much of a risk. Sentry Blue 87 shut down on us earlier in headcount. When he woke up, he had purple eyes. It didn't take long for them to return to the usual red, but that's not the worst problem. Sentry Blue 87 can't talk anymore. He always has a sad look in his eyes. I think he wants to be with his brothers. All four of them. It's only right I leave them alone from now on. They don't listen to us anymore anyway. The voices. I don't think it's God. Or the devil. But worse. There's something evil here. Very, 
very evil. This is drone 666. I'm reporting it with the weekly log. I don't think I can call it weekly now. There's only three days after the last. Two more of the Sentry bots left yesterday. The only one left is Sentry Blue 87. Drone 5769 went on a rampage earlier today. We have him in quarantine with the other two. Speaking of which, they woke up earlier today. They both had purple eyes. They were talking what sounded like seven different voices all mixed together, both evil and benign. They were not themselves. All they were doing were slamming themselves into the wall, the one closest to that mountain. That mountain. It's calling me too. I can feel it. I know I'm going crazy. I just know it. But I'll get us out of here. And then Scorpion can fix us up. It'll be alright. I feel him near. Everything will be alright. Everything. <laughs> the voices. This is Drone 666. I'm reporting with the weekly log. Century Blue 87 disappeared two days ago, and now we have no real defense against a foreign threat. Drones 867 and 8962 have also disappeared, and 5769 went into a coma just yesterday. He's going through the same dementia the other two were. Drone 627 told us earlier that he caught himself talking to nothing earlier today as well. He doesn't remember what he was saying, but he told me it sounded really bizarre. He told me to lock him up like the others. I couldn't do that, not my best friend. What if I started suffering as well? There'd be no one to let us out. So, I figured it'd be best to let 5769 out when he wakes up. He's gonna wake up with those purple eyes like everyone else. That's good news to report, though. All of our tools have broken. I smashed the computer monitor long ago. I also hear no more voices. The mountain looks far away now. That, 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 that's, that's good, right? Drone 666, weekly log. Looks like things aren't going to end well for all of us. I caught myself talking to nothing just before I started writing this log. I can recall talking to the shadow. The shadow that's been silently watching us, protecting us. Calling us. It lives in the mountain. I knew this would happen sooner or later, but it was inevitable. My best friend, 627, fell in a coma just yesterday. I'm not locking him up. 5789 has already disappeared. My best guess is that he's at the mountain with the shadow. It's an evil thing. To actually notice your own self confidence whittle away like a lit candle. If there's one thing I know about this syndrome, is that by the end there's nothing of you left. You're erased like a computer chip and overwritten by some horrible creature that can think of nothing more than serving this. this shadow. This shadow. It's spherical in design. And has something inside. Inside like a fetus. I must serve the fetus. I will please it with every last breath of my body. Drone 666. Uh, 627. I'm reporting with, with my log of things. That log of the log. And the log of my log uprised. Like the one floating down a riverbank. I see it now. I've seen the devil, and I've seen God himself. None reach out to me. I'm... I don't really know. The only one that offers acceptance is the shadow, the fetus. I don't remember who I am. I'm all alone. So very alone. I don't remember who our friends were. Did I have friends? I, I don't know. I, I don't care. The shadow is my friend now. I'll go to it. I leave you. But wait, one last thing. I know this. I'm crazy. I've become like the others I don't remember. I'm new. If you read all of this, you'll believe me, right? Right? Don't stay here. Don't you dare stay here. The shadow. It'll come for you. Run. Run for another portal before it closes. Or else, you'll be here for a long, long time. You get back, you tell them not to use that godforsaken machine. Tell them we're lost. Tell Scorpion we said bye.
Goodbye, log. I remember what I am, but it's too late for me. I'm about to go into the changing phase and lose myself forever. The last message was a little unclear. If you just got here and are still on your first day, you have a chance. The shadow knows. It knows. You run away from the darkness. You stay on the path of light. You find another portal and get out before it's gone. The shadow awaits. It knows me now. I get you and the little star shining high above. But I don't want to leave. Not... The rest of the log can't be translated. Yeesh. That sounds pretty harsh.